I'm not awkwardly walking to the camera because I got a new haircut. Who wants that? I can't hear you because there's like a line over the top of my ear. Because, you know, I got a new haircut. So it's graduation season, at least where I'm from. And I want to take this time to congratulate you all. Congratulations, congratulations. So here are five tips to help you with life after high school. Guaranteed to make you a millionaire. Tip number one, don't go to college. Ugh! College is such a waste of time. I mean, Mark Zuckerberg? Dropped out of college. Steve Jobs? Dropped out of college. Bill Gates? Same story! So why do I have to go to college just to drop out? When I can just not go to college in the first place? I mean, I can just be a billionaire without actually doing anything productive, you know? I love being part of the most entitled generation ever. We act like the world and everyone in it owes us shit because we're young. Huh? What? College? What is that? Is that the thing where you put pictures together? A college? Ah, no, not for me, no. I'm too cool for school. Let's face it, who needs college when everything's available online nowadays? I mean, why should I go to med school for 10 years to become a brain surgeon when I could just go to WikiHow on YouTube and learn from there? WikiHow, how to become a neurosurgeon. Went on YouTube, how to perform brain surgery, and it's right there. I was actually just being sarcastic about the entire thing, but turns out I was right. <laughs> Everything is available online. I guess sometimes it pays off to be an ignorant dumbass. Tip number two, don't get a job. Okay, so you don't want to go to college, and now you want to get a job, which you can earn money, which you can use to buy things that you may like, or maybe help out your parents in any way. All right, fine, okay, I get it. You just want to stay at home, relax, snuggle up in your couch, Put on Stranger Things, put on Game of Thrones, watch some anime, jerk off, play some video games, go on YouTube to watch The Sweet Prince of Asia, and maybe also follow him on Instagram at alexis.josh. Okay, now picture this, alright? 18 years of your parents busting their ass to make sure you have a bright future. Investing in you. Investing in your education. Making sure that you live a better life than them. And that you don't go through the same shit that they went through. And now you tell them these sweet, sweet words that they've been wanting to hear for all of their lives. Mom, Dad, I don't think college is really for me. I don't think working and also getting a job is also for me. You know what, now that I think about it, I don't think anything is really for me. I just want to stay at home and do absolutely nothing in my life. If I was your dad, I'd be so goddamn proud of you. I'd hang a medal, okay, around your neck. I'd kneel at your very feet. I'd lay out the red carpet in every step that you take because that's how proud I am of you. Piece of shit. Come here, that's my son, look. That's my son, hey, I'm over here. It's me, your father. I'm so proud of you, I'm so proud of him. That's my son, I'm so proud of him. Look, look, I'm here. It's no, I did it. You did it. <laughs> I beat him. I did it. <laughs> you did it. I did it. <laughs> My son, he did it. <laughs> I don't want to do it, but I did it. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> Woo! Tip number three take a gap year. Mom, Dad, I think I need to take a gap year just to figure out my options, you know? Two to three years pass by. Mom, Dad, I think I need to take one more year. I'm still figuring out my options. Now, is it good to take a gap year? Let's sass Google. Taking a gap year between high school and college can be tremendously beneficial to one's personal growth. Whether one decides on enrolling in a structured gap year program, spend time volunteering abroad, or simply traveling the world. <laughs> Absolutely. I completely agree. When someone tells you that a gap year is basically just you sitting at home for an entire year doing nothing, they're obviously full of shit. Have you ever dreamt of traveling the world but don't have any money for it? Well, just take a gap year and you'll be able to do just that. You don't need to have a lot of money or be a billionaire anymore. Just take a gap year and you can travel the world. How, you may ask? Well, a leprechaun riding a unicorn will come to your house and deliver a pot of gold to you, which you can use to travel the world for an entire year. Okay? So don't think twice. Just take a gap year. Tell your parents right now that you're taking a gap year. And come see me in the beaches of Bali or in the Eiffel Tower in Paris, which is in France, by the way. Yeah. Regardless, taking a gap year means that you're living life to the fullest. <laughs> Listen up, people! This year, I'm taking a gap year to live my life to the fullest. And the 
next year as well. And the year after that. 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 So basically, what I'm trying to say is, every year is a gap year. Let's go! Tip number four, party. Yeah, baby, live the life of a party. It's every day, bro. We're young. We're wild. We're free. We have all the time in the world because we're young. Live life without consequences over our actions. Planning for the future and doing the little things that add up to our dream? What? Ain't nobody got time for that. We're taking a break. We're on our gap year. We'll worry about that next year. Whatever we do today won't affect our future in any way. So get drunk, get wasted, take that drug, fuck that bitch, make out with girls, make out with moms, make out with grandmas, hell, make out with everybody. Because we're too cool. Okay, for school! Who cares if I like to party, get drunk, get wasted, and do absolutely nothing with my life? Who cares? I'm young. I'm wild. I'm free, you know? Free spirit, bro. Go with the flow, bro, you know? Okay, so a quick recap. You don't want to go to college. You don't want to work. You're taking a gap year for who knows how long. And you want to party all year. Alright, okay. So why not also just stop learning anything altogether? Wait. A 20 year old turned businessman turned millionaire is offering his advice for free for anyone who wants to learn? What? Uh, you know what, that sounds really nice, but it's not really my obligation. I'm not in school. I'm not even supposed to be learning anything. Huh? Is that Tony Stark from Stark Industries teaching kids how to be an Avenger for free? What? <laughs> you know what, I'd love to take up on that offer. But then again, taking a gap year and not in school. You know what, I'm a firm believer is you can only learn things when you're in school, college, or those places where they have a lot of books. I forgot what it was called, cafe, I think? Wattpad? Reddit forums? I don't know. But that place. So. I'm on a mission. A mission to find my purpose in life. Okay? You get me, bro? You get me? Of course you don't get me, bro. We're not on the same flow, you know? I'm sorry. Okay, so you just stay in school, I'll be out here, you know, finding my mission, finding my purpose, traveling the world, taking gap year after gap year after gap year after gap year, bro. So, I know. I... Lit every day, bro. Fucking I just lost my fucking voice because of this shit. So you better subscribe to at Sweet Prince. So better subscribe to my channel, Sweet Prince of Asia, and follow me on Instagram at Alexis.josh. Bitch!